Hello, welcome back to my channel. This is Shasha SJ. Thank you so much for coming by today. And today we are going to make a Santa gnome made from this. And of course, yeah, I'm wearing a hat right now. Though there's a tag on it. I got this from the Dollar Tree. And with this project, we are going to make everything from this and use everything from this, okay? for our Santa gnome and I am so excited to show you how I do this and so let's get started all right so we are going to start the one that I have here that possible that we need to use for our Santa gnome is this Yes, you can get this at the dollar store, and I got mine at the dollar store. Felt. I don't know if we're going to use this color. So, and I also have this kind of color of felt, so it should be white and then kind of tan. So we'll see which one we're going to use. And I have this facial hair. If you see in my previous video, I got this from Goodwill, so... And yeah, shredded paper. I got this one also from Walmart. You can get this as, uh, they have like decorative in there and see as you can see, I pulled everything out because we are going to try and use this to be our Santa gnome shoes. So it's going to be super cute. And I got this at Walmart for $1.98, so I don't know, but yeah, go grab it if you can find one of these. So it'll be super awesome and perfect. So we are going to make our gnome everything from this tiny little hat, okay? And if you can add on some stuff, you can add this. I don't know if we're going to use this. I don't know, so don't take my word. So let's put that aside and let's get started. First, what we are going to work on is I am going to cut this tag. <laughs> yes take off the tag and I am trying to save this hat in this area where this you know I want to save that so I am just going to cut this so now next is I am going to undo this So there you go. It's all taken and removed. I'm trying to save this fuzzies or the fur of Santa. So let's see how it goes, okay? So I just have to undo this one. So I guess, yeah, it works perfect. we're almost done there you go so we are going to save this and put that aside okay so what I'm trying to aim is I'm just going to make this one even just like that so hopefully it works out well okay so right now what we are going to do is we are going to glue from here here and here so I'm going to glue this. Okay, so we are going to make this piece dry and I don't want to force to open it because if you force to open it, then the glue gun will make a smidge on it. So while this piece are drying, we are going to make a gnome's nose. And I think I am just going to use this white one to be our gnome's nose or somehow like this. Let's do this 
tan one. And I have this base color. And I'm just going to use that for our gnome's nose. Okay. So what I'm doing, I'm trying to make a somehow like this square-ish or rectangular. And I am going to make this goes in there and the vase filler goes inside and I will just fold it all the way in so it's going to be our gnomes Santa nose okay So there is our nose, it's perfectly ready. Okay, let's open this one gently. There you go, it looks super perfect. And this is going to be our gnome's body. All right, so next what you're going to do is we are going to fill this up if you have a rock go ahead and put a rock on it but i don't have a rock right now i'm out and i have no time to go to the store so <laughs> what i'm going to use is i'm just going to fill this up with this shredded paper Alright, so as you can see, I filled it up and I tried to, not harder, push it in just to make sure that it's stuffed up in there. And look how cute that is. It's almost like there's a little billy belly in there. Cute. And what I have right now to tie it up is I have this tool on hand right now. And you can use a rubber band if you want to, but I like the one that over time i can save it forever somehow so i'm using this tool to tie my gnome's body or santa gnome's body there you go and you can just cut it down so what i'm trying to do is with this when i put this feet in here or the body's gnome it's kind of like showing that styrofoam so what i'm trying to do with this excess one i'm going to try to cover this up with this fuzzies on this end so it looks like it's part of that shoes you know if you know what i mean so i'm just going to put that one around As you can see it looks like a part of our snowman's boots okay so let's do the other one remove this tag and I just try to feel it with my fingers how far I need to go and I just have to cut it round-ish I like to estimate all the time guys so that's how I am <laughs> so there you go so you just have to put a glue around it all right so as you can see it looks like it's a part of our Santa's shoes so now we have our Santa's boots ready and what we can do is we can put that in there so it looks like Santa's legs. 
Look how cute that is. Isn't it cute? So, next is we are going to set the shoes aside and we are going to work on our Santa Gnome's beard and nose, okay? What I'm trying to aim right here is I'm trying to put this nose down here and I'm going to grab my fake beard, the facial hair beard of our gnome. So, hopefully it turns out right. And I have this perfectly angled, so I don't know if it works perfectly. So it does work perfectly, and look how beautiful that is. So, right now, I'm just going to start gluing this all together, okay? So since our gnome's facial area is already done, let's put this aside and let's work on our gnome's hat. What I'm trying to do right now is I'm going to grab this end piece of our hat. Remember I cut it off and I am just going to roll it. Just let it be like this and just roll it and close it with a glue gun. Okay, so... I'm just going to try and make this one even on the end so they're more likely awesome and straight and I'm not gonna cut this end first okay so let's put that aside so it's not going to be everywhere and I'm just going to glue this All right, since it's done, let's glue this. Let's start on the way back. So the back one is the spot where they meet on the back, okay? So I'm going to glue this. So there is our gnome's hat is ready and I try to clean it up because there's some red fuzzies in it so all right so there is our gnome's hat gnome Santa I mean <laughs> all right so I'm trying to clean this fuzzies as well so they look super pretty all right let me clean this one up all right, so I was thinking, guys, I want to make a hand for our gnome, Santa. So this is going to be the sleeve or of our Santa. Remember, I put this one aside. So I'm going to use this as our Santa sleeves, okay? So remember, guys, I always don't waste anything. I always use everything. So we are going to use this as our Santa's arms okay and this tan one so it matches his nose is going to be his glove so what i'm trying to do is i'm going to fold this just like so and i'm just going to cut an angle where santa's wearing a glove so i hope it will work perfectly because i am one of those that i just don't know how to make hand glove so this is just going to be his gloved and tucked in like so so it looks like he's wearing a glove and what I'm trying to do right now so it looks like an eight somehow just like that I'm just going to glue this and tuck this one inside our gnomes sleeve <laughs> So 
So what I'm trying to do right now, I'm just going to put this in here and tuck this in and put this in like so. So it looks like our Santa has a hand in there, okay? <laughs> So there is our gnome's arm and we are almost done guys. So next we are going to grab our gnome's head and put our gnome's hat. I'm trying to make this triangle that's supposed to be flat right here and I'm trying to hide this on the side. So I am going to put this in here just like so and I'm going to glue this one and Put this hand down here and another one down here. As you can see, now it looks like our gnome has a hand. Isn't that pretty or what? Okay, now I'm going to glue this all together and stay with me, okay? we are done so what we are going to do is we are going to put our gnome's legs down here our gnome got a legs then you can glue that in place okay so that should look like that and I'm going to show you how it looks how our gnome standing okay <music> super easy and fun DIY and I hope you like it and here is my Santa gnomes closer look super cute with a hand on it it was super cute and easy guys and I really really enjoyed it and I hope you enjoyed it too and yes thank you so much for staying with me today you guys are awesome come back next time see you soon you have an awesome awesome day